I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. Thank you for being so cooperative about all this, Bruce. It really is for the best. For everyone, really. I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. Of course, Regina. Whatever I can do to help. That's good, Bruce. Trust us to sort this all out. Everything will be fine. Already then, we are going to make quite a splash today, aren't we? I don't think I'm ever going to forget this day. Beautiful weather, corporate intrigue, a well-deserved comeuppance, a noble hero riding in to save the day. Happy to be here too, Oz. Really? Thank you, Bruce. I appreciate you being such a professional. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me? Take it everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. No, dear. Not even close. No one's gonna follow you around and take pictures now. It'd always be sad if you were so bloody handsome. The children of Arkham handed you this coup, Oswald. You didn't earn any of it. Who cares? It never really matters how a king comes to sit on his throne, Bruce. The only thing that matters is that it's his bum warm in the chair. This is just the first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Wayne, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham. What happens to my company is up to the board. I think you're a little deluded about the type of power you're going to have. All in good time, all in good time. It's amazing the sort of patience I've developed over the years. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it. Just tell me. I have to know. No, uh, uh, that's not what I asked. Pretty please. Turns out your dear mum found out what your daddy was up to. Threatened to turn him in, she did. She said she didn't want to be a part of it. Now you can imagine, Hill wasn't too keen on that idea. So he slid a few dollars Joe Chill's way and, well, you saw the rest, mate. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, in light of recent allegations against my family, I have decided to voluntarily step down as CEO of Wayne Enterprises. I know what my father did. I know how much he hurt you. But I am nothing like him. His actions are his own. Stop trying to save face. I have complete faith in the board as they work towards righting the wrongs of the past.
Mr. Wayne, are you having trouble reading the teleprompter? Uh. <laughs> Speak up. Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior today. Nice After statement. All, he is the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. It I did what I felt was right. So yeah, well, someone has to. I just didn't think it'd be you. It's not an easy thing, seeing something you've come to have as part of your identity. Dropped your pen. You're very That's done. <coughs> taken over by another. I should know. I should. I'm sure some of you remember the form of beauty of Colin You feel that? Now That's a drug taking hold of you. And forgotten. A you. To the terrible You're with the children of Arkham. No, I am the children of Arkham. Something that has affected so I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. And you already know the Penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, the smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we can just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Way! <sighs> Ouch, someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? Wow. Who would have thought Vicky Vale was the criminal element? Okay, so 60% of us chose to help the lady officer. And we chose to punch Oswald. Or no, we kept our composure. We didn't punch him. We asked Lucius to stay as our inside man at the Enterprise. And of course, 90% 90 of us decided to stay with Selena at night at her place. And then, wow, a majority of us decided not to physically attack Harvey. That's interesting. Alright guys, let me take a quick couple 